Hi everyone welcome to my channel, in this video. I will test the Thunder Obet G45 Pro in Android games and emulators. Before I start please help my channel by clicking the like button. It's a really big help for me and my channel, thank you. Our first test is the one of the good FPS game Farlight 84. This game supports controllers, as you can see it's accurate and no delay while playing. Now we move on to the Android emulator, which is Vita 3K emulator. Playing JSTARS vs Victory Plus. I'm amazed by this gamepad cause I'm not having a problem in any games and emulators. Which is very good for gaming. The next one is Citra Nightly Build. One of the best choices for low and mid-range devices. Playing Pokemon X is one of my favorite games in 3DS. It's been a month since I test the Citra which is a good update by the developers. So many features added and also they fixed some graphics issues. Last but not the least, is Switch Emulator which is Yuzu. These emulators having good feedback in the last few days. They fix some controller issues and also a good performance. By adding debug features, in this latest update in get the huge performances on my Snapdragon 778G. With 8GB of RAM. 
I'm not having a problem now playing one of my childhood games. Dragon Quest Monster, as you can see it's now playable and smooth. I have been playing this for an hour. If you are asking about the temperature, you won't believe its temperature is still normal. While playing this emulator. With a Bluetooth controller like I'm using right now. The game is smooth and stable at 30 to 40 FPS which is good for stable playing. These mid-range phones can now handle this emulator. Without any lagging, good job to all user developers. So what about your thoughts about this update? Comment down below, I will love to answer with all my knowledge. I hope you like my video. Thanks for watching, see you on my next update.